Hi everyone, welcome to Sarojini Smart Learning and thanks for watching all my videos and writing your comments on that and for the last few episodes we are doing different different topics and I am giving the basic information on the topics. So in the last episode we have discussed about LCM. Okay, so the continuation of this LCM is HCF. What is HCF? We will find out. HCF that means highest common factor. So here we are going to deal today with a topic called highest common factor. This can also be called GCD. So greatest common divisor. You can also call it GCD or HCF. HCF is nothing but highest common factor. Now just like LCM. LCM is least common multiple. We took out the multiples. Then we took out the common multiples. Then we took out the least common multiple. That is the way we have done. So here we have to do highest common factors. First of all we should know what are factors. Suppose if I take 6. So the factors of 6 are 2 and 3 because 2 into 3 is 6 or 3 into 2 is 6. So factors of 6 are and similarly if I take 12. So these will go in 1, 12 is 12, 2, 6 is 12, 3, 4 is 12, 4, 3 is 12, 6, 2 is 12 and 12, 1 is 12. So these all comes under factors of 12. That is 1, 2, 3, 4, 6 and 12. Suppose we I can stop here also. Because 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 12. Also you can write down in this way. These are the factors of 12. Suppose if I take a number like what is the highest common factor of 12 and 24 if I give like this so as you know already LCF now this is totally different that is HCF HCF is highest common factor now first of all we write factors of 12 so factors of 12 means just now I told in which table these will go so 1 12 is a 12 it will go 2 6 is a 12 it will go 3 4 is at 12 go, 4 3 is at 12, 6 2 is at 12 and 12 1 is at 12. So these are the factors of 12. So why I took from 4 to 6 because in 5 table 12 would come. And 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 table also 12 will not come. So we have to check in which table 12 will go. So this is the main concept. Now coming to factors of 24. Yes, I am giving a number, an example. So factors are 24. So 1, 24 is a 24. Basic number will be 1. And next, 2, 12 is a 24. Now you have to check if the next number is 3, whether it will go uh, 24 in 3 table or not. Yes, 3, 8 is a 24. As I already told you, you must be thorough with all the tables from 1 to 9. It's a minimum uh, thing you are going to learn. So, sorry, I, I wrote 3. So, 3, 8 is a 24. Then 4, what about 4? 4, 6 is a 24. 5, it won't come. 6, yes. 6, 4 is a 24. 7, won't come. 8, 8, 3 is a 24. Okay. Then 9, it won't come. 10, no. 11, no. 12, yes. 12 times 2 is 24. And 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. Also, it won't go. The next number is 24. It will go. 
So 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 8, 12, 14 are the factors of 24. Suppose if you cannot guess this one, as I told, you, you can write down 24 is 1, 24 is a, 2, 12 is a, 3, 8 is a, 4, 6 is a. After 4, next is 6. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 8, 12 and 24 also you can take it. Right? So these are the factors. Now, what are the common factors among these two? What are the common factors among these two is? 1, okay, 2, done, 3, okay, 4, yes, uh, there is no 5, 6 is also okay, 7, no, 12, yeah. So these are the common factors for these two numbers, that is 12 and 24. Now what is the question? Highest common factor among these, which is the highest common factor? Highest common factor. In the last episode, we took the least number, that is the smallest. Here highest means the big one. This is the highest one. So that is 12. So the what is the HCF of 24? 12 and 24 is nothing but 12. In this way, we can find out the highest common factor. This is one method of doing. There is also division method is there. We can do little bit shortcut. In a shortcut method. So you would like to learn? So definitely I am ready to express. We said now. And what are the numbers we took? HCF of 12 and 24. And just know what we call greatest common divisor. That means your division concepts also included in this. So whenever you get two numbers like this, what we are going to do? Always take the bigger number first, 24. Always take the bigger number, 24. And that number must be divided with the smaller number. What is the smaller number, 12? So this is divided by the smaller number that is 2, 12, okay? And it's so simple is, in 12th table, do you think 24 will come? Because you have to again learn 12th table. 12 ones are 12, 12 ones are 24. So 12 times 2 is 24. It is exactly dividing the number 24. So with which we divided the divisor, this is the highest common factor. Or Greatest common divisor is 12. In one step you get it. Suppose there is a number, there is a number like 12 and 26. Now you want to find out the highest common factor for this or GCD. So the bigger number is 26 is divided by 12. In the same process, 12 times 2 is 24. So here on subtracting, you left 2. So the remainder is still left. That means that the sum is incomplete. So how to complete it? How to complete means again this became the divisor and the first divisor become the dividend. You bring down the 12 here. So 2 times of 6 will be 12. So now the whole reminder is 0. So this would be the HCF of 12 and 26 is 2. Apart from 12 and 26, they never meet at any place. So this, this, this would be the highest common factor. So hope you understood this one. So these are the basic things in the last episode we have discussed about LCM and in this episode we have discussed about HCF and in the next episode we will discuss in the bigger numbers like uh, we will take the bigger numbers okay. So hope you understood and try to share the maximum people uh, who are watching these videos to your friends, relatives and your known persons so that they can get some idea about these mathematical skills okay. So have a nice day. Thank you.